morning everyone so today is monday the 17th of january so it's the first monday of week one at oxford hillary term so i thought today that i would bring you to my day as a first year mathematician last term nearly all of our lectures were pre-recorded so we spent a lot of time in our room we didn't really go to the maths institute that much so yeah i'm really excited i'm going to meet a friend at 8 30. today we have a analysis two lecture at nine from nine to ten and then we have linear algebra two um between ten to eleven so yeah let's get going um please don't judge the thing behind me um the tutors have already laughed at me my friends already laughed at me um yeah i have lots of food on the shelf behind me the bookshelf yeah the one that's meant to be books um especially lots of milks at the top so yeah i hope you enjoy spending the day with me and let's go try not to be late on our first day. I thought that I would show you this sign because Lewis Carroll went to my old school and he also went to Christchurch, which is where I am now. And one thing that I appreciate about the first year lectures is the consistency. So every morning from Monday to Friday, we have lectures between 9 a.m. and 11 a.m. and they're always in the same place, which is L1. So today we started with a one hour analysis lecture, which was our first lecture of analysis two. So analysis one looked at more sequences and series, whereas analysis two looked at continuity and differentiability. So we basically started with some recap from analysis one before moving on to some new ideas. Lily, are you like a Why do you have that What do you feel about lectures? Yeah, we just had one of our lectures. It was really good. Yeah, it was actually analysis. was, honestly. The yeah, the lecturer was very... Get used to it, yeah. Enthusiastic. Yeah, you're really good at explaining stuff. Our second of two lectures was on linear algebra. So Monday was a really pure day where we basically met the determinant for the first time. Since further maths, we hadn't really covered it at all in linear algebra one. It was really interesting because it was explained in a lot more of a rigorous way in comparison to A level, where a lot of it was memorizing methods. Plus, you know that it's rigorous when the lecturer says with 20 minutes left to go until the end, oh, we'll start this proof, we won't have time to finish it. After lectures, a few of us went to a cafe near Christchurch where I got a matcha latte. What did you get? Just a mocha with soy milk. Do you want to say hi, guys? How are lectures? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's nice and ham. So I am back. Um, it is currently 12.50. I've also had lunch. And in-person lectures were good. I really enjoyed them. Um, the lecturers were really... It just feels different to have them in person. You could just feel like the lecturer's enthusiasm and energy and it just felt like more interactive because the lecturer could be like, you agree? And then you could like nod, I don't know. So I'm now going to do like a few hours work. I have the afternoon free, which is lucky because I have some linear algebra sheets due Wednesday. So it's actually like quite a way away, but I want to like get ahead of my work this term. My New Year's resolution is to actually study. So I'm gonna try and get the sheets done. I'll be really pleased if I can get them done by the end of today. We'll see how that goes. So the lecture we had this morning was linear algebra two and the sheets that I have due on Wednesday are linear algebra one, which are from last term. So I guess the getting ahead of work is not going that well, but yeah, so I'm gonna try and do those. But the in-person lectures I felt like were a lot easier to engage with because online, you know, sometimes you're midway through and you speed it up to like 1.5 and then towards the end you speed it up to two times speed and then you switch it off all together and go and get coffee or like go for a walk. So the in-person, like you're there, you're there for an hour, you have a break in the middle and you have another hour on a different topic. And yeah, I just thought it was really nice. Um, I plan to go every morning at 9 a.m. So yeah, time for some linear algebra one. So I'm now going out for dinner with my college dad and he's actually a math student as well in second year. I've just been doing problem sheets all afternoon. I also quickly went to the gym. Um, I was doing linear algebra one, um, which you think is easier than linear algebra two, but because we're still on early stages of linear algebra two and I'm doing like the very last parts of linear algebra one, it's very challenging. It's about like change of bases. Well, it's hard for me. I don't know if it's hard. The T is that I also got my collection mark back, what, my first one. Um, so it was the probability part of the applied paper because we had a different tutor marking that part. So I'll let you guys find out in one of my videos how I did. So I will leave that 
as a cliffhanger but yeah i'm gonna go i'm so hungry i feel like i really want something like deep fried and like oily and greasy you know so hopefully we, like we can go somewhere that serves that After Wendy's, so I did get my fried food, I spent a couple of hours in the Christchurch library just finishing off a problem sheet from earlier. This term I've really been getting into studying in library so far, I find that I'm a lot more productive and another study space that I've been liking is the Maths Institute and we cannot wait for Cafe Pi to open again. I hope you enjoyed seeing my first day of lectures, hopefully the first of many and I'll see you guys very soon, stay tuned for more. Bye.